I was a walking up White Copper Alley, as I was a walking on what and fine day. A lass neat and pretty from Fair London City, her cheeks were like roses, her colour was gay. And I step it up to her, thinking to gain a saying, Where are you going, my pretty fair maid? And kisses I vended, and love I pretended, the all was in vain, for she was a maid. I cannot, I will not, I shall not, I dare not submit to your passions For I am afraid friends will discover I have a new lover And then they will call me a wanton young jade But I said, me dear, there's no need to fear We'll go to some inn where we shall not be known And then she relented at last, she consented But first kind sir, some money pay down Here in these words it may be right anxious to think I should purchase a pretty fair maid And when she demanded five guineas was granted And when we'd had supper we went to bed But I being tired and weary of drinking And I being tired and weary of play I fell a-nodding and she fell a-robbing And left me old bedroom before it was day And I turned to kiss her and then I missed her I looked for me wallet right under me head But the lady had plundered I roared out like thunder All was in vain for the lady had fled And it's not me gold watch or miss silver I value It's not me gold watch or miss silver I crave I think some young doctor will be me conductor I wish I'd not met with that pretty fair maid At a new sons of high renown To these few lines which I pen down I was born to wear a stately crown And to rule a wealthy nation I am the man that beat a below at warm as hell did them subdue That great archduke I overthrew On every plain my men were slain Grand travesty I did obtain And I got a capitulation well, we chased them on the Egyptian shore Where the Algerians lay all in their gore The rights of France are for to restore That had long been confiscated We pursued them all through mud and mire Till in despair my men retired And Moscow town was set on fire My men were lost through sleet and frost I ne'er before received such a blast Since the hour I was created well, in Leipzig town my soldiers fled Mount Mark was strewn with the Russian dead We marched them forth in inveterate streams For to stop a bold invasion So it's fare you well, my royal spouse and offspring grey to my adore And may you reinstate that throne That's torn away this very day The ace kings of me have made a prey And they've caused my lamentation My 
by the margin of the ocean One pleasant evening in the month of June The pleasant singing blackbird His charming notes to tune T'was that I spied a woman All in great grief and woe Conversing with young Bonaparte Concerning the bunny bunch of And then up and spoke the young Napoleon And he took hold of his mother's hand Oh mother dear be patient And soon I will take command I'll raise a terrible army and through tremendous a danger go And in spite of all the universe I'll conquer the bonny bunch of roses oh. And when first you saw the great Napoleon You fell down on your bend And you asked your father's life of him And he's granted it most manfully T'was then he took an army And all oh, the frozen Alps did go And he said I'll conquer Back for the bonny bunch of roses oh. And so he's took three hundred thousand fighting men And kings like wise for to join his throng He was as well provided for Enough to take the whole world along but when he came to Moscow All overpowered by driving snow And Moscow was a-blazing And he lost the bonny bunch of roses Oh, oh my son, don't speak so for England she has a heart of oak And England and Ireland and Scotland Their unity has never been broke And so my son, thank God you're a father In St. Helena is a body it lies low and you will follow after Beware of the bonny bunch of roses oh. And it's goodbye to my mother forever For I am on my dying Had I lived, I might have been clever But now I bow my youthful head And while our bodies do moulder And weeping willows over us do grow The deeds of brave Napoleon Will sting the bonny bun Roses all by the margin of the ocean. One
pleasant evening in the month of June The pleasant singing blackbird Is charming notes to tune T'was there I spied a female All in great grief and woe Conversing with young Concerning the bonny bunch of roses Rise up, my pretty bodily, rise up and go with me. 
I will let you he get to North Scotland, then you're mad it to be. Go fetch you a bag of your father's gold, some of your mother's fee. Two fine horses out of the stable, they're starting dirty and three. And so she's lit upon her nimble going brown, and he's mounted the dapple grey. When they've come to North Scotland, it was just a three hours till day. Light you down, light you down, me pretty Polly, light you down, I say to thee. Six kings' daughters of I drowned and did, and the seventh will surely be thee. And pull off, pull off your fine the gay clothes, hang them on a yonder tree. But they are too fine and they cost too much for to rot in the salt lake sea. Well then you get to sickle and you cut down the nettles that can grow so close to the brim. For I fear that angle me long a yellow head and they'll tear me lily white skin. And so he's got to sickle and he's cut down the nettles that can grow so close to the brim. And she's picked him up so skillfully and she's pushed the false knight in. Lie there, lie there, me false young man, lie there in the room of me. The six king's daughters of you drowned and the seven's drowned to thee. So she's looked upon her nimble going brown, and she's led the dapple grey. When she's come to her father's door, was just a three hours till day. Hush up, hush up, me pretty bonny bird, and don't you tattle tales on me. Your cage will be made of the very beaten gold, and the door of the best ivory. But then up a spoke a fine young man in the chamber to where he lay. What's the matter, what's the matter with me pretty bonny bird, you're talking so long for a day. Oh, there's two black cats at me cage and door, and me life they he will betray. And I'm just a-calling for me pretty Polly for to drive the cats away. And he's followed her up and he's a-followed her down, and it's into the room where she lay. She had the strength for to flee from his arms, nor the tongue for to answer him nay. I've a mind to venture where the cannonballs do fly All along with me love I'll go He says, me lovely Nancy, I hope you'll not repine For I must go on board our noble fleet to join Our orders are to see me dear and now we must obey And behind me you must stay Says me lovely William, oh don't you leave me here I'll dress me as a seaman and along with you I'll steer Oh let me go along with you, your messmate for to be And I'll fight so manfully But he says me lovely Nancy, great danger is at sea Perhaps we may be shipwrecked or else be cast away And in the line of battle perhaps you may be slain So behind me you must remain and your pretty little fingers they are so long and small you'll think it but hard usage how our cable ropes to haul when the winds they do blow high and the billows loudly roar at home you must be on shore
So now my love is gonna brood as I do tell you plain Kind heaven shall protect him while he's ploughing on the main Protect him from all danger when the cannonballs do fly And send me William home again Away and away and away went he 
And when he's gotten to bait a madden's chamber down, he fell upon bended knee. What news, what news, says Lord of Bateman? What news have you now brought to me? There is the fairest, a fine young lady as ever my open two eyes did see. She bids you bring her a slice of bread and bring a bottle of the very best wine and not to forget the fair young lady is did a little you in close confined Bateman arose all in a passion he's broken his sword into splinters three Oh, I'd give up all my father's riches if my Sophia has come from sea. But then up spoke the young bride's mother, who never was heard to speak a so free. What will you give to me, only daughter, if your Sophia has come from sea? I own I wed your only daughter She's neither the better nor the worse for me And she came to me on a horse and a saddle She'll go home in a carriage and free Bateman's prepared another wedding With both their hearts are so full Nevermore will I range the ocean now my Sophia has come from sea. Dance to your daddy, my little laddie, dance to your daddy, my little man, dance to your daddy, my little laddie, dance to your daddy, my little man. You shall have a fishin', you shall have a fitting, you shall have a head, and when the boat comes in, dance to your daddy, my little laddie, dance to your daddy, my little man. You are a man and fit to take a wife. You shall have a lassie, love it all your life. Dance to your daddy, my little laddie. Dance to your daddy, my little man. She will be your lassie, you will be a man. You shall have a family, love them all your cat. And dance to your daddy, my little laddie. Dance to your daddy, my little man. Dance to your daddy, my little laddie, dance to your daddy, my little man, dance to your daddy, my little laddie, dance to your daddy, my little man. Well, it's over two brothers are going to school. Are uh, going to the very same school, and one of them to the other says, Can you take a wrestle and the fall? And the very first fall that the eldest gave. He's felled him to the ground, and he's taken out his little pen knife, and he's given him a deathly wound. Take me up, take me up, all in your arms. 
And carry me to yonder church ground And dig a grave both wide and deep And gently lay me down So he's took him up all in his arms and he's a carried him to yonder church ground, and he's dug a grave both a wide and a deep, and gently laid him down. And what shall I tell my mother dear? This night when I go home. Just tell her I'm running in yonder green woods, a bringing my school books home. And what shall I tell your Susie dear? This night when I go home, just tell her I'm down in yonder churchyard. A buried beneath the ground, but she's a wept and she is cried so bitterly. She's a wept from door to door, and she's a wept him away from his old gravestone, for rest he could find no more. And why do you weep, my Susie dear? And why do you weep for me? It's just a wooden kiss from your clay lips. That's all I ask of thee. Then go home, go home, my Susie dear. Go home and leave me be, and don't stay here to weep and mourn, for my body you'll never more see, and it's of two brothers going to school. Uh, going to the very same school, and one of them to the other says, Can you take a wrestle and the fall? Oh, it's of a sea captain down by the seaside, oh, and he's courted a young lady, and he's got her a by child. Go and fetch your father's gold, and the sum of your mother's money, and go all across the ocean, all along with the young Johnny Now I've got me father's gold And the sum of me mother's money And I'll go all across the ocean All along with the young Johnny Now they hadn't been a sailing, no miles, not a great many, before she was delivered of a beautiful baby. Go and fetch a white napkin for to tie me head easy and quite overboard both me and my baby now see how she totters and see how she tumbles 
hands and see how she's rolling all upon the salt water. Go fetch me a logging boat for to roll me lava back again. For to roll me lava back again, both of her and of her baby. For she shall have a coffin, and the coffin it shall shine yellow, and she shall be buried on the banks of green willow.